The Chosheva is a Shiva, which I'm proud to be a cousin of. The Shiz Kalakul Akudish Hazeh. I stand in front of you with an awe and a Yudas Akudit. I know that I'm standing before a Heiligit Sibir of elevated people, people that are chosen by Hashem. And it's an achrayas, and I mamish tremble. When I got the phone call for Abavi a few days ago, I was humbled. I have discussed that I've spoken for Abavi several times on several occasions in different forms. But I know that this time, tonight, it's different. This is the greatest COVID that he's mechabed me to speak to those that are the closest to him, to the greatest people he's affiliated with. Rabavi calls it TP, Twisted Parenting. And then I got a phone call for Abgedalia Miller's Lozan And again I was humbled. Our Shaykh is his only Toyota. Abgedalia is a Mechadish B'Toyota. And Abgedalia calls it Kesha Nafshi. A spiritual connection of souls. And there is a connection between both names, TP and Kesha and Nafshi. And I would like to address and find a connection between both names that connects to the message that we want to take out tonight. We're gathered in a tremendous time. It's a Gewaldiga Yisrutzen. Jetzt is the Ike von Chanake. As Davne Neza points out several times, Chanukah and Pirim Atuyim and Toivim, that there is no Havdula because we never leave go of that Yom Tif. As my uncle, the Heilige Nesi Vishulam Tzchis Ingleini, would say that the Gemurra says in Shabbos, O Meruvah, Ho Yatufis Neh Chanukah V'Oymet. If someone stands and holds a Neh Chanukah in his hand, Lo Yusuf V'Lo Yiklim, he has to put it down. He didn't do nothing if he just holds it in his hand. And he says, the Remez is, when it comes to Neh Chanukah, the Tachlis is to take its light and go towards it the entire year, not to be an Oymet. Chanukah is not enough for the days of the Yom Tov of Chanukah. You can't be standing, you have to be Hoylech towards the light, according to the light that you received. And he points out that the only two times that we say Vihi Noyam after a mitzvah, different than the Rizal established, you should always say it before a mitzvah, is Motzah Shabbos after Shabbos we say Vihi Noyam. And Chanukah Lech after we kindle the lights we say Vihi Noyam. Because the Tachlis of Motzah Shabbos is to continue the oil of Shabbos for the entire week, and the Tachlis of Nechanukah is to continue the oil of Chanukah for the entire year. We're gathered here to hold on and continue the Orif and Chanukah for the entire year. Let us be misbeinen a little bit. What is the Koyach of Chanukah that pertains to us? How can we continue it and draw Chizik from it to our personal lives and our personal challenges? We know that the Ike Koyach of Chanukah is Yan Vivino. All Mekubalim bring it, the Gra brings it, the Kedusha Slavi brings it. Chanukah is connected to Yaakov Avinu, and Yaakov fights the Klippa of Yovan. The Koyach Betuma of Yovan is connected to Koyach Hagdushif and Yaakov Avinu. And we know Yaakov is connected to Chanukah, there's a Sefer Berkeshmul that brings from the Shach al Yaakov made a Metzeva after he saw the dream, Sula Metzavar Zerosha Megia Shemaim, it says, Vayatzeik Shemen al Rosha. He took a jar of shaman of oil and he poured it on the matzeva. Zuk the shach ala that this pach shaman, this jar of oil was a pach shal nes. And it's the same pach that the chashmanoim find in, found in the Beis HaMikdash. And on that jar of oil, says the Megal HaMukas, was the Melchumif and Yankiv Mitzorah Shal And as the Marshal brings a medrash, the Ebesh that told Yaakov, you went past the river. There's a tremendous question in Ashaykh and Yankiv and Chanukah. What is the connection and how does it pertain to us? 
We know that Yaakov Avinu was the one who was such a mitzvah, he toiled with children. The Medrash tells us in Eicha that Bashas the Chorbim, all the others got up and tried to hold back the Chorbim in their merits. They brought this Chusim. Yaakov pleaded and asked Bashus, one merit that I have, I was Megadol, 12 children. I was metapel with them, I was amal with them, I had toil, I had torture, it was pain and had anguish. I suffered because of them. And as Chazal tells us, he had so does Shimon, so does Yosef, so does Dinah, so does Binyamin. He suffered so much of his children. But what kept him going? What was his koyach that could be our koyach? There's a parsha. Says the Balaturim, Sasama says twice, Bashem Doisha Rishumois, he refers to the Minchas Shai. That it's the only parsha in the Torah that there is no psuchas. It's a parsha that's kulois tuma. It's a parsha that's miramas to golos. The moment that Yaakov left Beeshava on the way to Choron, was the worst moment in the lives of our others. What a terrifying time was it for Yaakov. Yaakov leaves his father's home, Yitzhak Soma Beshava, he goes away from his Medesh Aleva. Esau chases him to kill him, Alifa takes away his wealth. Where is he going to? They love on to be Oisik Begashmias, to toil, to the Chmitchen and Chasnobum Kinder, be Oisik and physical. The Medesh says, Vayele Charana. It was the worst place in the world for Yaakov, Choron. And Yaakov spiritually, could we imagine what a downfall? A person of the Torah testifies about him, he didn't sleep 14 years, he was engrossed in Torah, in Plitzling, Vayishkav, Shokecham, Shaloi, Benosa, Kiba, Shemesh, and his Angish, Lofun, Ochet. The Medish has an expression about Yaakov at that moment, Bikish, Yankiv, Lavor, Venasa, Kolowoilam, Kimin Koislafun of Yankiv wanted to go out to Chutzlers, and the whole world stood against him as a wall, as an expression that you have today, try to climb a wall, that was the massive of Yaakov at that moment. The Gansa Velt, the Gestana, the Avanti couldn't move. And in that terrible, terrifying massive of Golis, Yankov broke out of it and he paved the way and it all getreit na veig zich zahalten in gulis. What was his koyach at that moment? Says the Medrash of Shmuel Benacht ben Posach an introduction agdama to this parsha Shir la malos esa eina lahurim ma'ayin yuvay ezri. Yankov picked up his eyes and he saw mountains. He saw ayin nothing ma'ayin yuvay ezri. How could I have help? I'm at the worst matzav that could be physically, spiritually. And for the Medrash, Elo, Ezri, Me'im, Hashem. But his koyach, his Ezer was, Me'im, Hashem. What's this word that the Medrash is Moisif? Elo, Ezri, Me'im, Hashem. Ezri, Me'im, Hashem. This is the word Elo. Noch Ezri, Me'im, Hashem. It should have said, Ezri Mei Hashem. What does it mean, Ezri Me'im Hashem? I believe that there's a Moiridig in the Kiddah here. And a Kiddah could, that could literally change our lives, help us in every Matzah. There is sometimes a person that waits for Yeshia, He hopes, he has a Muna, he gives Tzedakah, he davens, he longs, he waits, he wishes. But until he's helped, he suffers, a and it's very bitter for him. Yankov over here at Oskitreit Machidish Utsum, he was Mechadish, he paved a new concept, a new idea. The Rebbeinu Shloylam is with me now in the Tzura, noch far ich zeh, as ich bin geholfen geworden. I have Ezer, and I have help from the Ebeshter, from the fact that he's with me, and I know that he's attached to me, and as a chaylik for me. The first time in the Torah that it says that a Yid gets an Avtucha from the Eibishter, and the first time in the Torah the Ramapana and Repsudik Amarech is the headquarters, it's the Shoirish from Indian. The first time in the Torah we find that the Ban Shalom tells the individual, Anoichi Imach, I'm with you, is in that moment, that terrifying moment of Golos that Yaakov had. The Eibishter tells him, Anoichi Imach, Ishmaticha Becholash Ateilach, I'm with you, and I'll guard you, and I'll go with you, and I'll accompany you to wherever you'll go. Now, over here, when you're still 
before such a long journey of suffering, you're on the way to Beis and you're still going to be suffering and tortured by the Malach Shalaisav. Physically, he's going to affect you. But I want you to remember, not forget for a second, I'm with you. Ich bin eins mit dir. In Tehillim Tzadik Aleph, there's a Pasuk, Imoi Anoichi B'Tzara. When a Yid is in a Tzara, Zuk to Rebbein Shalom, Imoi Anoichi, Ich bin mit Eim, Ich lasse up alle Himmel, And alle Maluchen, Ich lasse up alles, Imoi Anoichi, When er is B'Tzara, Ich bin mit Eim, I'm attached, As the Maral says, Imoi is the greatest of the Weikers, And not Itoi. I'm one with him. And this is what Yankiv, A Klitzling Margish, Gewein. He feels that he's in a terrible state, What's going to be? In the grass the gulas, parshas vayaitzai, charoina shaloylam alz brand, kaloylam kimin koisel lefunov. And he says, esaina elaurim, I'm picking up my eyes, all I see is mountains, everything is locking on me, closing on me, choking me. My eye in yuvayazri, I don't see any hope, how will I be helped? And his answer that he answered to himself was, Elo, there's one way, but there's one answer. Ezri me'im Hashem. Noch fas it's on Ezri Mei Hashem. It'll be that day that the Eibishter will help me. In the Chalzach Ostraim from Mansura. But before that, in the Tzura, Habecha Ezer finzan me'im Hashem. Finzan imoi anoichi b'tzura. This Mizma in Tehillim that we say, imoi anoichi b'tzura is shir shal paguam zuk de gemura. Mugnavrum brings from Tashbitz that this was the weapon, this Mizmar, that the Chashmanon went out to Malchoma, connected hundreds of thousands of Greeks of Yivanim. They went out and they didn't see any hope. They're Ma'atim, 12, or maybe 3, Siskeli Kedayas, maybe 13 people against Revuvus, most powerful army in the world. What are we doing? Are we committing suicide? We don't know, we don't see. But we have one kayach, imoi anoichi b'tzure, and as a chav demai b'shem kenach. They have one little jar of shaman. What's the point? According to Adam of it wasn't enough for one night. Zichah not for eight nights. What are you doing now to light and kindle a kleine jar? Ichav demai b'shem nima anoichi b'tzure, ichal teen months. And when ichav demai b'shem nabach alle kayches. This is the side that's mekayim and holds yidin and gulas. We find there was a vision of a snare that Moshe saw, the Psiris HaGe'ilif in Gulus Mitzrayim. What did he see? Koitzen, a snare, brent mit amoyde de gefaye, a snare boye ba'eish, a labas eish, a flam fire. And he wonders, my dear Yibber, a snare, a snare, any equal, how could it be it's not getting burned up? There's such flames here. What's the koyach? The Teret says, well, the Eibishter was there, as Rashi brings the Pasuk, fin imoy anoichi betsura, as the Rabbein Shlalom is do. Can brand and fire Allah be say? Shall be mevet the shall brand mahalzich and mahat koyich to continue on and to go on and to do what we have to do. This is what Yaakov was mashrish and planted in and ingrained in us at that parshas vayetze at that moment. Vayetze shteit from chamer tovu from bar and beruf shteit from him renoyim shteit from shiyeschein shteit from magal amikus vayetze is netraik and zurushet ayvus vaya Yankov tzirus aleph Yankov zayt the tzirus the image of the ois aleph. What's the remez? Aleph zuk de zoira kudish is neutraikin rushetaibis lais asar puni menai. There's no place in the world vacant of Hashem. Hashem is all over. Aleph is rushetaibis lais asar puni. There's not a place that Hashem is not with you in the worst matzav, in the darkest matzav, in the most suffering matzav. Yaakov saw an image of Aleph, the Ibish is mit mich, yetz, afili, yetz, do. And it's mind boggling from a matzav that Kaloilam Kimin Kaisel Lafun of the whole world is against him like a wall. He has to climb mountains and he doesn't see any Aza, any hope, any chance. He breaks out and he receives this heavenly vision. Anoichi Imach. And the Ebishta tells him, Mishmatiche Bechalashatelech, wherever you'll turn. And he inherits this Nachlabli Mitsurim with no boundaries. If Aratz the Yom Akeid Matzvayna Venek, but wherever he turns, Hashem is with him. Aleph Leis Asar Puni Se Shtuka Platzun Dema Ibish Ne Imo Yonoichi Da Ibish Is Met Mich Bitzurim The Gresh Bitzurim, and he breaks out. And at that moment, all of a sudden, it's easier. He has Koyach. But Yisro Yaakov Raglov the Trash and Nasa Libay Kala Leches He Vetem Gringa from Hearts Le Leches He Could Go. He could truck, he could, he could, he could go more, a can guy, a can zich stippen. Weil er mahat dem Eibishten hat mein Koyach. Das ist der gewaltige Sot von Chanekif und Imo, ja neuche Bezure.
Und ich glaube, dass ich eine bessere Zeit habe, wie Reb Gedalien, alle Teile jeden, der now to absorb and take in in ourselves, light up in our lives this message. Nicht du kann besser jeden wie der Zibbe du, Ralf und der Eulem du seht noch nicht lehen, nein, die Yeshia. But they have one thing, the Rebbein der Shalom is with me, now over here, at this match of Bitsure. Er begleit mich, he accompanies me. I have him in the depths of my Tzure, in the Labas Eish, Sometimes, Salomon do Tzuris by Yid, no Ba'amul, sometimes, get a flam of a leib, as if you love us Eish, Amulu dos Machlis, Amulu dos Panusa, Amulu dos Shedichim, Av Shulam Bayis, and I've added the topic from Kinder, which is the Tzuris Adar, Se brand flam flak of fire, but you will not be ukal, you won't be burnt if you have the Koyach of Ima and Oichi Betzuris. And when you have the Rebbein Shalom, it's not just that you don't have a tzura, you're helped, you have everything. It's something that you feel all of a sudden, you have strength. I have a mina, and I could continue, and I could go vata. That's the koyach of Chanukah, that the Chashmanoim draw from Yankah, that was mashur it for them and for us. And we're here gathered to take this oil and continue this to the entire year. Now where did I come to this thought? Slonim and Rebbe Zalzan Gazin, Tufshi and Samach Vuv, was in a terrible crisis. We're first cousin, and I know the insides. His Rebbe was very young and terribly sick, and she did the last Ishtadl, she came to America. Her, she had no lungs, no kidneys, and the Matzav only worsened over here. And the doctor said she'll never make the flight back to Etzisrael. He was over there, and she was over here. <laughs> and the Rebbe said he has a Kabula from Azubis that he shouldn't leave Eitzis rule. She didn't want him to come. It was a terrible matzah. It was Erev Chanukah Tufshi in Samach Vuv. I remember that day. And I heard the episode from my cousin, the Slonim Rosh Hashiva, the Moshe Bezovsky Zazan Gazim, the son from the Rebbe. It was Erev Chanukah that the doctors gave her 42 to 48 hours. At that point, the Rebbe was considering to break his Kabula and maybe yes, go to Etz Yisrael. They reserved four seats on a plane. He asked the Zikna v'chashuva Yatsibur to come, go with him. And she insisted he shouldn't come. She knew what it means for Aslan and Rebbe to leave Etz Yisrael. Chanukah, no way. He came out and he said, cancel the, the, the seats. And he told his son, the Rosh Hashivah, and I saw the tzibur from over a thousand people that came from all over Eitz Yisrael to take chizuk for me. I was devastated. I was besides myself. I said, I'm so tzibur. And I couldn't walk. I was mesamek in the pusik imo yonoichi betzur. I focused in on these words, that and all of a sudden I felt like a wave, like a zerem from chizuk and strength. And I went in and chagitzinden and chagizoktim shmos. The Rosh Hashiva tells me that there's a rav in Beit Vagan. He told me his name, I don't remember. That the next day, the first day Hanukkah, had to speak an event for 300 couples that Nabuch don't have children. And he had, didn't come up with anything to, to tell them. But he was more moved when he heard the Rebbe say, but this is He didn't know if this whole episode that took place with the Rebbe, he didn't even know the Rebbe's not sick. And he decided he'll tell them, you know what, I don't have what to share with you, but I can tell you one thing. You're in a terrible tzura. I have children, I don't understand your tzura. The Eibish is with you. Now when did I feel it? I heard Slonim and Rebbe yesterday say, I felt it, it resonated into me. It went into me, it felt like electricity. And he imitated the way the Rebbe said, Now, I'm not here to promote Slanam and Rebbe, his doesn't come to America, as I told you. But tens of people called this roof to ask him, could you imitate again the way the Rebbe said, tell me that, the tune, the tune, the hearts. It's that message that I didn't hear with my physical ears. That all of us want to hear the message from Imoy Anoichi Betsura. 
This is the site when Hanukkah was Megaita knows the Eibishter is due. He knows exactly what you go through and he accompanies you a begleitach in the eggs the minute. Now, how does it have a direct shaykhist to our matzav? Let's bring it down. The Rabbi Nishaloylam is our father and we're all his children. Bunamatam Lashem Alekaychem. I heard many years ago from Afeta, a cousin from the Rosh Hashiva, Reb Chaim Vakshal, to Megazuk, Tshtayt and Ahgudavis Amulayni Ayli Habunam. The umal, the toil, the zechnitchenen, belonged for the kinder. All of us have careers, businesses, we're associated with so many things, enjoyment and pleasure, gashmias, rachnias, umal, belonged for the kinder. A person is created for Amal to give to the Toldas, to the Yeladim, to the Yevalid, what you brought into the world. And if you invest Amal in something else, you're literally stealing the Koyach, the energy that belongs to your children. Amaleinu elu abonim, the main Amal belong to And he told me, Arala, I'm to Gestazana Tata Hashem. And you might have Tsar Gidelbunim. Gidelbunim itself is Tsar. You'll have to run in the middle of the night to make a bottle. You have to go get a medicine. You have to go to the doctor, put up with a chutzpah, with an actor. At that moment, you should know that what you do, do of their belt, shuckles to Oivan and Himmel. What we do in this world is Ma'ira Oivan. Hashem Tzulchud is like a shadow that does exactly what we do. At the moment that you do for your children is a time that you could daven as the greatest Esrotzen that there is. And when you wake up in the middle of the night and you're tired and your eyes are verklebt and you're making a bottle, Tavon zug de Beuschlum, kick the sich tief am Mansin. Kim, TD, Famich, ich bin dich danken. Du verklau Yisrael, they're your children. That was the message that he gave to me. And trust me, it made a lot easier. The bottle makings or anything else that we have to put up when we toil with children. Gewald, gewald, I don't know who more could have in this tefillah, who more invests more amal toil than this tzibbe here, who more is amal and toils for children, that Messiah the Sneifish Lamalamateva, mit blood, sweat, and tears, than this oilem you do for your children against all your middas, every second, 24 7. It's shuckles alle himlen and alle welten. There's nobody greater than you and closer than you to the Rebbein Neshaloylam. There's no one that has the Rebbein Neshaloylam more imoit, imochem, Hashem alakecha imoch, than this oilam. In ganz klal Yisrael, kick the rose and waits for your tefillas at these terrifying, terrible, challenging moments that you have with your children. Rabavi told me, was the mother al of If a person goes against his midas, against his feelings, against his wants, his desires, his wishes, sanaritsoinus, is mavidim memeni kol pshuav. Ich glaube, the oimek is, while the svasem is brengt, as the gresta void of the welt is the avoide, fin bitla yeshes, shvesta avoide. But when someone is maver al midoisov, what does he do? He's negating his being, his essence, his bevatel, his yeshes. And at that moment, there's no more pshuam. The pshuam is only chal on a chalois, on a yesh. But if you go against your midis, there's no yesh to carry chatuam. And there's no yesh to carry dinam. And you can renew yourself, renew the world, bring yeshias. By Savroam at the Mulgevain to Rashashun and Gazuk, the Zoyer says that there's a Makatar Gashashun, a Ploini Uvit Kach, Ploini Uvit Kach. This person did a Zoy, Dea Vaida, Dea Vaida, we like to do a Ploini, Kamazun Uvit Kach. But Sukhmavatl de Yesh, there's no more Ploini, can't be a Zoom Uvit Kach. Sukhmavatl de Yesh. Rabbi Sai, Ed sends Sukhmavatl de Yesh 24 7, there's no Ploini to carry any Dinam, any Chatuim, any suffering, and it's Kens Banai and Amamtigzan al Dinam, Sarachman for the Ganze Welt, Banai in the Welt with Mashiach, Vibit Balzain, this is what's Ed states. Tonight is the Yurtzat from Rebchaim Shmalevitz, Chisig Nalaini. It's been a six day war. He was in a shelter with his Bukhrim. And it was, the radio was saying that they're having Mamish that needed Nisim. It was a terrible matzav. The Israeli forces were Mamish losing it. So those Gazains came to Kloy of Klal Yisrael. And Rebchaim, at the most moedic of him, Tashmiz the Bukhrim, Yedas will name an Akabula. Akabula's Emmas was a Pekir Nefesh. And all of a sudden, a lady stood up and said, Rosh Hashiva, I want to share with you something. 
I am 21 years myself. Ich bin ein My husband left me 21 years ago. He took away my money. He tortures me. I stopped saying Rabbi Nishlalam before Krishna. I am Michael, but I can't even say Michael. But yet, I am cool. I call a kids and call Yisrael guy tinta. I am Michael him, and she yelled his name. I am Michael him. Rabbi Nishlalam, the schiz dad. I am asking you, be Michael, call Yisrael and save us. While she was saying, this radio was saying that there is gaba here, the strengthening here, and they won the war. And so when I said this, I do it, me and the Pcham Shmalevitz Gazuk, my mind said there, Gudel said there, my kibble said there, Kabula said there, Toyra, there, throw the Agina, at Mavi, given on my dice of what Kapoil to Yeshia. Gewald, Gewald, when it's in Smaver, on the dice of Mazeta Kin, the Megeta Mahog, and Emta Maran, against everything that you believe, that you feel, that you want. In Yana Menit, Poyltitz Yeshia, Snissim in the Fluas for Klal Yisrael, for the Hex, the Menit, Davin, Satsun Zin, Yiddish, it's Ruchim, Yidin, Davin Yeshia. What an Esrutz not you creating. And remember, Ima Yanoichi Bitsuri, you have Hashem with you. Davin for Zich, for the Vab, for the Man, for the Kinder, for the Eltern, for them in the Kens, for Klal Yisrael, for Shinta the Galisa. To understand the godless of the tzibah that's gathered here, I want to share with you Riksha slave, Hirhurim. We're all at the end, in the worst part, in the darkest, lowest part of this Golas. In Medav, Poyon, the Gila, Shlaim, is Ashalaf and Take. When I mention that for tzibah, it's a kim taran, 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 an elderly lady that called my father a year ago and asked him, Yudel, ich bet, zos maskezan, she's a slana mechsidus tefen daheim, a lady from the high 90s. Zos me maskezan, ba slana merebe, eva askure. What's the askure? I'm old. I'm sick. I'm suffering. Ich will nicht leiden. The rebbe zol davon, ich zol endig ma leiden. I can't commit suicide. Ich will nicht leiden. Yudel was metzi gesucht. My father was besides himself. What should he do? So he called the Rebbe. So the Rebbe said, I'm bitter as Kura. No. At the demand where he is, and he said, he will not live. The Rebbe said, he's a The Rebbe told him, Judel, so go. As in heintige Zeiten, was mir leben, is kedai, zu davon, in a beten, a verichis, jummem, ach, verrak, zu de leben, lebe dig, meschich, zu keine meschich, kind schon. So shoot, not to go in labor. So how can we to labor? So it's a question of days. Mashiach is here, but we need a koyach. We will to break and put it on the gulas and the sibedrain to get ill. No, as always, my mom shecha yeshia. Yitzur and the oiras no mina choshech. Last the oiras look the zoya ill. Then ufik megoyche shoycha. Oir was kimter al dafke from afinstenish. We find this concept that in order to draw a geila mizmen hub ma special koyich was also brechin the gulas, but gulas mitzrayim the zoya says gulas mitzrayim but shoyish kol gulias the source the fundament the base of all the gulias that klal yisrael had afterwards geilas mitzrayim is the source the shoyish and all the geilas was yidnam gehat from buvul from mudai from yuvon and as oil leuse the gila shleim mitzrayim kemei says chemei mitzrayim and in the fluids it's also ingrained in geilas mitzrayim the shoyish from the gila seed. Who's the guy now by the koyer? Was that zebrach and gulas mitzrayim? And pirates give in gulas mitzrayim into geilas mitzrayim. So we have to be misbeinah. What was the reason that Yidden were in gulas mitzrayim? Moshe wonders. Metama, as Rashi says, Eizus chis hab me Yidden lias near the mavoidus perech favus. Oy kaval duch enoida adover. I know. I know why. Yes, but nein the latirin the moisrim. Yes, but nein balo lushin hara. They speak lushin hara. What's the common denominator between the two? So the Rambam, a moiser, who says to you the guest of Mibel and Malchus, so stop him forgetting him. Ich maser him. Lushen hara him forgetting. My Yisrael lebal alushen. English. So Rabbi is asking me to speak English. It's in the right moment because there's a yid. There's a gavendu aruvim providence of Ushaverna. And he was a genius. He was afterwards Reuven Tveria. And he learned English through the Sonsino Shas. And he said, 
he said that English is actually a very rich language, that there's many, many vocabularies for every word. It's not my first language, so he could help me out, Rabadi. But there's one word that I didn't find a translation in from English to Yiddish, faginen. I tell you the, that tried to give me an English word for faginen, so nishdu azavart. And that's exactly what we're in the middle of. Gulus Mitzrayim is giving. Gulus Mitzrayim was English in Faginen. I don't have a word in English. And therefore, to bring the Ilus Mitzrayim, we needed a Kayach of Faginen. I and Toiva being happy for Yenem's joy. So, how did Gilus Mitzrayim come? David tells Moshe Rabbeinu, you're going to be the Manik, the Rabbe, the Moshiach, the Goyal Yisrael. Look, Moshe, I have an older brother, Aaron, one minute. He is the Rabbe of Eden now. He's 80 years there suffering with them in Mitzrayim. I? I wasn't base Paroi. I wasn't Midyon by Yisroi. He didn't don't know me. I'm younger than him. Why hurt him? Shlach no biyatishlach. Send Aaron Akoyim. I don't need it. I don't want it. Nebuchadnezzar says, don't worry. I want you to go. Aaron Akoyim. V'ra'ach v'somach b'liba. I promise you at the Chvaginen. You won't have a problem. The kash is mind-boggling. Why hurt Aaron Akoyim? Now, I have to be politically correct. Let's try to imagine what's happening here. Let's take a Hasidus. There's a Rebbe there. For 80 years, a good will be a Shrul, And we tell him one nice day, resign, go home. We're bringing, we're importing a younger brother from Yudi Bist Os Rebbe. Egad the Rebbe. And he doesn't even need it. Why do this? Why challenge Aaron Metazana Sayan? The Teretz is Valgulus Mitzrayim was in Faginen. And to draw Gaelus Mitzrayim, we needed a force, a koyich, to break that shtait, a el to the breed, a and he sees a younger brother Moshe, and he's stepping aside. Oh, yet's kim Gaelus Mitzrayim. Now let's go to our last Gaulus that we are now, because of it, gathered here. The Geula see the state ain you. The prophet Malachi says in a noichi shalech lechem esli yov novi novi lifne boy yemesh ama gudul vanoid of a heishiv leiv uvus al bunim leiv bunim alavoisam. That will be the tafkid, the work that Elio will have to do before the Geula shleima. Return the hearts from others on bunim a bunim alavoisam. Because that'll be the biggest challenge at the door for the ikvus of the Mashiach, as the Mishnah says, be ikvus Mashiach. In the Shpeta, Shpeta, Doidus before Mashiach, what will be the Simonim that you're there? Nikvois Mashiach, Ben, come, Ba'aviv. Children will stand up and pain and cause anguish to their fathers. Bita, Be'ima, daughters will hurt their mothers. Chutzpah, Yazgid, the Chutzpah will go up to a level that we won't be able to even bear it. And as the Gemara Chagiga says, Shaya cursed Yidin with 18 curses. It was a Nevoah. He couldn't hold back. Abba Neskara Radate, when he gave the 18th Nevoah, Yerhavu Anar Bezok and Yong should not have their Echeretz for old. This is the Nisoyen Adair. Not only by Yidin, by Goyen, by Umasa'ilam. They're challenged and they're full of fear of this new Ruach, this new wave that parents are literally afraid of children. Children not only curse, not only pain, parents, they hit the parents. They abuse the parents. This is the Nisayan of the Dar and the Tkifa. And this is only a simon because we're so close to the time of the Geula Vusadzan, the Heishiv Leibo Vusabunim Leibunim Leibo Vusabunim Kim and the Geula. And it's not a suffix by me that parents that sit here, they are the ones that are breaking and challenging and defeating and conquering this terrible Nisayan. Them is Gaber, they rise, and the mother on the Midas, and Oifun from Sirius Nefesh, Lamala, Mateva, they embrace and they hug and they shower unconditional love for their children. They are the ones that are Mamshech the Geula. And I believe that that's the reason that the Nisayan becomes so much harder and so much more difficult. Every second, every moment, it gets worse and worse by our children, in Klal Yisrael, in the world. Because this is Alts Aros Sishlepen, to draw and bring out, to be Megala from you parents, Azamin Koyich, Fin Meishivzan, Leivuvus Albunim, Levbunim Alavoisam, which is breaking this Golis and literally bringing Mashiach. How great is Yeschus! To you will Eliyahu Anavi come! Come will the day, and the day is so near, that Kranz Klal Yisrael will see that you are on the forefront from Klal Yisrael through your steady, constant base, avoider. 
of 24-7 being Mekayim, the Heshiv, Levuvus, Abunim, Labunim, Lavoisam, and Gans, Klal Yisrul, and Pamal Yishomal, and Daibish, and Allah Maluchim, and Allah, Uvus, Vimus. We'll be Maketoiv to you. You were chosen to this Heilig Avaida. Now we're coming back to TP, Twisted Parenting. So anyone was not even getting in the shvel from TP knows the Heilig Avart from the Siva Shulam. I was like to hear it myself from him. It's printed in a cipher that there's two times Vayemuin. There's a Vayemuin less Nachem. Yankov refused to give up on Yosef. And Yosef, by a man, he refused to give in to Potiphar when he was challenged with that Nesayan. So one is connected to the other because Yaakov was by a mindless Nachim and never gave up on Yosef and cared for him and felt him and showered love and a Tananga Blusen from the Vatans, Ahava. Therefore, Yosef had to strengthen Koyach to stand up to Potiphar and be Mekayim by a man, by Yomar, Potiphar, I don't want it. And as Avi adds, Shal Sheles is the Tam, is the Trap. And the word Vayimayin, that through Vayimayin, from Yankiv, he connected Yosef to the Shalshele Sa'uvis. So we all know this word that Avi made world famous. I just want to add as a Matuna Toivet, some oilem. Vayimayin is Rusha Toivet, Apusik, Rabbi Nefraim, Zuktas Arishim. Ma Yofis umana amt ahava, but Tanugim the Pasik says, Ma Yofis umana amt ahava is Vayimayin. How beautiful, how sweet it is when you shower a have to your children. You refuse to give up, no matter what. No matter what he does, no matter what I'm challenged with. And you implement in him, you ingrain in him. You plant in, in him a kayach to be by a moon to the Nisyayin Sadar and give up on himself. The only way is through my yufus man am tahava. And how is it connected to this time of Hanukkah? So the Mesech to Soifrim, the first source is on Hanukkah. That says the halucha is mezuzah b'yemen nechanika b'small. The right side from the doorpost and the left side is nechanika because the pasuk says my yofis umana amt, my yofis be mezuzah umana amt nechanika. How beautiful is the mezuzah? How sweet is the nechanika when they're together? What's the shaykes? Let's open our hearts and let's remember this always. Chanika is the only mitzvah that we do al pesach beisoy mibachutz. And the doorpost outside, Bachutz, the Koshnet Samag, the Vajas Yisrael points it out, what does that mean? By Yidin, you always do a mitzvah inside. You run away from the Tumah from the street. Bachutz is a mukkah for klippers, for chetzainim, from Alush, Schwarz, from Schwachkeiten, from Chashkes. Zuk, the Koshnet Samag, the Tachlis from Nechanika is to light up those who exited the bias. Those who are me Bachutz! Those who are in the streets, in the klippers and in the Timahs. Light them up. That's the Nechanika. Put it a Pesach base on Mibachutz. Those who left the Pesach Abayas and they're ready in the streets, Mibachutz. And light up the Mezuzah. Show them that the door is open for you. What's the idea behind Mezuzah Zuk the Rambam? The essence of Mezuzah is to remember the Rabban Shalom. When you go out of your house, you come up to the house. It's a turning point when you go, when you leave the Shvel from the, the doorpost from your home. Which is again to light up the mezuzah to those who left the house to the outsides. Show them that the door is open. This Nairo is this earth in Kedusha from love, from Vayemun, from my Yufus, from Anaam, from Mezuzah, from Nechanika, I have an Elton to you. Come back. Maybe you'll want to turn back one day. Keep the door open, light up the doorpost. And this is what the Nechanika is to remind us, and this is why we're gathered at these moments. Rabbi Gedali, you think it's a coincidence that the Matzah Chanukah didn't work out Matzah Shabbos or Thursday night? Because yet this man was man zuk nisht avdule, man emt Chanukah met ziyich, me gezegen sich nisht. Nechanika is a oir was malaykt of Pesach, beisam me bachutz to those who are bachutz. And we show them there's a mezuzah, there's a door that's open for you, mezuzahs, oisi yezaz, moves, and you can remove death, spiritual death, physical death. And all is through the Avoide, the Nesiv Shulam that Rabbi gives over, Vayemu and Lis Nachem, showering in, infusing, recharging your children with the Kaich, Vayemu and Tipatifar, through the Rabbi Nefrai, my Yufisimana Amt Ahava, giving Ahava unconditionally, no matter what. I'm ending with a story 
But one word, Beshuschem, to share a fascinating Chiddush that I'm saying here, the cover this island. Three minutes. We all know that one of the Rishonim, Rabbeinu Gershom, is referred to as Rabbeinu Gershom Ma'oyer Hagayla. The one who lit up the Golas. Why does he have this title? He's entitled Ma'oyer Hagayla. So we all know because he established a cheirem with two parts in it. One part is you're not allowed to forcefully divorce your spouse. The Begin Shmagadr Zana Isha Bal Karcha. And you're not allowed to marry two wives. So why was the mayor the Goyla with that, those that cheirem? Because in Gulas, we are in a relationship with the Rebbein Shlom, we are his Kala, Knesset Yisrael Kala, Kru Abanima. And even if we fall into a dark Gulas and Chatuim, he cannot divorce us and push us away and abandon us, Balkarcha. And so can he add another nation. So Rebbein Gershom is the one with his Cherem, this Takana, he was Mayor the Goyla. Now I want to say tonight a new Tam. And a new reason why he's called Rabbeinu Gershom Oyer Hagoyla. There's an unbelievable Oyer Zerua that the Oyer Zerua says in Hilchas Avelu Simetuf Kuf Ches from the Rishonim. He brings a din that if one of the Zion Kroivim Shmatzich, you have to be misabel on him, and he adds Rabbeinu Gershom Oyer Hagoyla was Ms. Abel on a child that he lost that went off derech and hat sich geschmacht. Then there's a Matchen Moyet Kuten who also brings this din and he also brings the Kacho Yemasu Verbeini Gershom when his son left Yiddishkeit and there's a Gersa even his mother. Now I believe as low dame haben uns an andere Pshat, leider, leider, why he's called Ma'ira Gaila. Because in Ikvese de Meshiche, this is the sign of the door, OTD, children leaving the derech. And there's so much parents that are tzaddikim, they're nothing at fault, they're not guilty at all, but they're caught up in this gezaira because as Ikvese de Meshiche, Ben Kambomis, Bita Beema, Chitzpe Yazgi, and Habi and Abbe Zucken, it's a gezaira, far, le yuit, kime, vahesel, vavusa, buna, buna, malavaisa. But sometimes, sometimes Yitzhahara comes with all types of thoughts to put in guilt into you, to break you, to sadden you, to make you into yish, to despair, to make you fall. Remember, remember, Rabbeini Geshem at Kaina Chalila Nishmalazan al Adas, that he's guilty in any way or form in having a child like that. He also had a child like that. That we don't know, as my cousin the Rosh said, we don't know why. One day we will know. Rabbi Nigesh Ma'ayra Gaila. He lit up the tinkles the part, the spades the part from Gulas. When we are suffering, Tanazalchan Asyainas was kinder, Shlugan ends, and Shlugan the Mishpucha. Remember, Rabbi Nigesh also had a child like that. You have to be Mechazik yourself and know, Imo Yanoichi Bitsuda doesn't mean Hashem abandoned you, doesn't mean Hashem is Mashlich you. And it's a terrible feeling. Vus is ayid, not a hoben kinder, not a raisin kinder, it's a frimkai, it's a maibishn. It's a shluchem al play a meilich lechayre. This is what I hear from parents. The answer is, yet you have the gelegenheit, the opportunity to bring imai anoichi in this tzura to believe it's Hashem. He's with you. Ebagleitich. And when you have that koyich, you have the koyich. Nas liba kalaleches, you could go, you could continue, you could push. Kens gaim varte. You can continue to do what you have to. Don't blame yourself. Don't feel me yish. Deal with it. Be mechazik yourself. So I'm ending with a story. But as a simon to everything we spoke, it's a little amal amazman. Late. Let's use the initials of this one organization, this one umbrella, TP and Kesha Nafshi. Twisted Parenting from Reb Avi, Kesha Nafshi for Reb Gedalia, which is one, and let's use it as a similar to everything we're speaking here. There's a Kesha Nafshi between you and the Rebbeinu Shalolim, which is Mamish Twisted Parenting. It's true, we're parents to our kids, and that's why we're gathered here. That connects us. That's the common denominator. But let us twist it. Let's twist it. We all have a parent, the Eibishter, 
and he's and he's mekusha to me bekesher nafshi no matter what. And how are you bringing the Eibush into your life by doing the right thing by you connecting to your kids by doing practicing twisted parenting and being mekusha to them. No matter what, when it's difficult and challenging and frustrating, and your mamas feel like you're gusting, you're plotting. But nevertheless, you continue to go on, and to do what you have to, and continue to try, and connect, and hug, and embrace, and shower. My yufusim on the arm, tahava, unsinid and echanik of the Pesach Baisa, of the Mezizah, I feel if today was an emebechit, this is TP, this is Keshanafshi, this is one umbrella. And we're all being mechazig ourselves for our children, and through that drawing Hashem to us. So here is the Maisa. That came up on my mind, Hant Machmitu Gabachmain, as this is a Moiri de message to all of us. It's a Gewaldige Gudel that his name was Repshaya Bardika. He was a son in law from Bisrol Shaklava, the Pasa Shilchan, from the Tamida Hagra. And it's well known that there was a Aliyah from the Prussian, there was a Aliyah that the Tamida Hagra went up to Israel. And this Rabshaya Bardike, Nabuch was an Alman, he lost his wife, and he had one son and one daughter, a Ben Yuchid and a Bas Yechid. And he decided to join the Aliyah, and he decided to take upon him this journey to Etzis Ruh. This Maise is a Maise Emes, who do Aydem to them, that wrote it at the time. Rabshaya Bardike went out on a journey on a ship, with his son and daughter, only son and only daughter. And they were hoping to start again a new life in Etzis Rul, a new page. But in the middle of that trip, all of a sudden, a terrible storm falls on the ocean, tremendous waves, and the ship is starting to shake, and the waves are getting more and more, the ship is starting to mamish throw itself. And they realize they're in a tremendous crisis, they're in danger, they don't know if they're going to make it, I can imagine Altsweint, everything is davening, everything is screaming, and the ship is mamish throwing itself at this point from one side to another, and it happened, it broke! You're all in cold water. Rabshai right away grabbed with the right and left hand his daughter and his son. He's in cold water, between waves, in the middle of a storm. He oriented himself and he said, I'm two hours away from the port of Haifa. It's about two hours of swimming. No other way. Pekirch Neifish. And he starts to swim, holding in his two hands his son, his only son, and his daughter, his only daughter. And they try to help him. You can imagine, after an hour swimming, he feels, this is it, his kaiches are leaving him, his bones are becoming like stone. And he realizes very quickly, there's no way he's going to make it together with both children. Maybe if he leaves one child in the ocean here, He'll be able with the other hand still to try to swim and save himself with one child. Now who is he leaving? He has one son and one daughter. Ben Koidim Labas, I'm sorry, Bunim the Mechiyah the Mitzvahs. He tells his daughter, I have to leave you over here. What should I do? If not, we're all lost. Tata Gas Mechtu Ibelazen in the middle of the Chvali, it's middle of the Vasa. What should I do? If not, we're all lost. I'm a spal for you. Hashem should send you. The Gemurah says, a daf shall spin, maybe a malach. Try to do it. Go next to us. Try to swim. But if I'm going to still hold you, I'm mamish feel, I'm, everything is breaking in me. We're, we're all lost. You can imagine the machza, the vision between heaven and black, stormy waves. There's a fear well. The tatig is saying, She's weeping, he's crying. And it comes the moment he says goodbye and he opens her hand. And she falls into the cold water. At that moment, she shrieked, Tata, they lost the Mechibah. Tata, where are you leaving me? Where are you dropping me into a sea? Instantly, he grabbed her back and he felt like new kaychas are waking up in him, new adrenaline, new energy. And he continued to start swim again and he made it to the port of Haifa and they were all saved. From Haifa, he traveled to Yerushalayim. He was a famous person at the time, the Mechabadim and Chorvitz Rabbi Dachusid, to come for Shachris. He was Euler, he benched a Goymel, then they were Mechabadim with a Drusha. And he shared this episode with the Euler. 
And he said, Rabbi Isai, what's the lesson, what's the limud? We're all children to in the tata, to the tata in Himmel. But sometimes there's an hug of Hester Punim, there's an hug of Din, and there's a psak minatoyre that the Abishta says, I have to open my hand and drop you into cold waves, into a sea. And this is the machlis, the redifas, the tzuras, the pain, the anguish, the blood, the tears, the suffering, the ghoulis that Yidin are going through. It's an hugif and hester punim. And you cannot change it. But you have one way if the Yid stands up and screams and shrieks and shouts, Tate, they even lost the Mechibe! Tate, and Himmel was the Chman Tate! For who's all the Chladen? You wake up new Koiches, you wake up a new Anhuge, you change the Din to Rachman, you change the Hest to Punim to Uris Punim, the Ebishter grabs you back and rescues you and saves you, and you make it out from the sea. This is the Mushal Venimshal, Sanishka Mushal, Sa'emes Amasa, and Sanishka Nimshal, Sa'emes Limit. But what is it, Nagaya, to us? We parents, Ala Tatis, Machen Hand mit mit Kinder. We all are trying to swim in a terrifying storm from terrible, terrible waves. And we feel so many times that our Kaiches, our Lazen Zakaus, our bones are like stone, we can't move. Climb a mountain, I can't. And you feel sometimes that you're opening your hands and you're dropping your son. You're closing the door. And that could be at a time that he stole your car, he robbed your credit card, or he acted up. And you feel you want to open your hand and drop him into a sea. This is it. Enough is enough. Rebavi. Metalotoidus doesn't refer to me now. Please remember that moment. Please remember and open your heart, your soul, your ears to hear the child is screeching. Tata, Vayman lost the Mechibe. Tata, where are you dropping me now into the sea after I did this worst of the worst? Now when I need you most. Hear the voice screaming in him, even if he doesn't scream it physically. His whole soul, his generations, his kinder, his Eindiklach are screaming to you. Tata vei melast Grab onto him, even if you dropped him. Hug him again, embrace him again, take him in again. Against all odds, against everything. Against all the nesioinus. And at that moment, koiches will wake up in you. The Eibishter is with you at that moment to give you new adrenaline, new koich, new energy, new strength to keep on trucking. And at more than that, at that moment, you're shliach of Klal Yisrael, you're chosen, challenged by this Nesoyen, to draw the Gres de Rachman from Zebrechen de Gulis, from Ikvus of the Mashiach, this is the Nesoyen, you're bringing Mashiach so many steps closer. And at that moment, be even the Lesater is saved and blayled. What he does in this world, the awakens of Yenavel, Tashem Tzilchud, the Lashlam is like a shadow. If you grab again back onto your child, without any koyach, what are you married? And even an emel that a boy nishaloylam strikes those on hand to chop the trick and claw you through. He picks up those suffering amongst us who is not suffering. Wait, ich kalachen in the hearts. Wait, ich kalachen leiden. As Almuna told me, this world is a big show, a big play. Who wins? The one who acts best. But everyone is just acting. Some of us cannot even act. It spilled out on the face. They don't have koyach to act. Yehidah talach in hearts. There's so much machlis. There's so much mental machlis. There's so much redifus, gzairis. So much choyse panusa. There's so much amongst us that are suffering with children, suffering with parents. So much amongst us that are waiting for children. Shadichem and Shulam. So much fear, so much phobia. So many tears that are flowing from Yiddish Apeinim of an Oda Ebesh Tavayis. Hestepunim of the Hexta Madrai Ganoichi has to ask you because we're so close to Mashiach. Sashud nishtadeleibim leibedik, tindirichtigazach. 
Gewalt, Gewalt, when you chap on your child. At that moment, as Rav Shai Bardika said, the Rabbi Nishaloy Lamoivin chap trikun zankin. And he changes down who gives an Esther Punim to Eurus Punim, from Din to Rachmim, from Suras to Yeshias, from Tsar to Brucha, and from Gulus to Geila, to the Hei Shiv Levuvus Albunim, Levunim Alavoisam, Twisted Parenting, Kesha Nafshi, from the Eibish to Taos. With Bias Mashiach, Yavavia Galaini, Vimhairo Biyamaini, Omain Vimhairo Biyamaini.